Um, and it's nearly 60 years in business. Martin's closes one of its stores. Yeah, it's true. CBS 13's Brad Rogers explains this decision to close that Martin's in Rumford had nothing to do with sales there and had everything to do with ongoing and unresolved safety concerns. Customers showed up at the Martin's in Rumford not realizing the store closed for good on Wednesday. Well, I had no idea it was closed, and I'm, I'm really surprised. Martin says the building is no longer safe for their customers and employees and puts the blame squarely on the landlord. I read the sign over there that says that the owner doesn't put money into it. It's not plowing the parking lot. Uh, I think the owner ought to pull his head out of his ass a little bit, you know, and... Uh, get things cleaned up. The Martin family says our hands were tied by the landlord's inaction to deal with ongoing major safety concerns. The roof has been progressively failing for years. Martin's general manager Craig Burgess says the biggest issues were a leaky roof and a parking lot that often wasn't safe to walk on in the winter. Despite you know really many years of trying to get it resolved we finally said Enough's enough. We can't guarantee the safety of our customers. You'd think that he would make an effort to fix that roof because look at the rent that he's losing. Like many customers, Priscilla Hodgkins and her niece come here for the bargains. The next closest Martins is an hour away. I mean, it's going to hurt the community a lot. Employees of other stores in this shopping center say they have the same problems. Customers also see the issues. You know, once in a while you see a bucket where the water's running, but you, you see that in a lot of older buildings. We reached out to the landlord based in Caribou, but have not heard back. You know, Rumford's economic development director says he's been trying to work with the landlord on the maintenance of the building, hoping to prevent what happened. We really, really love Martins. And uh, for us, it's really hard uh, to think of Rumford without them. And so we're going to try and find a way to help them stay. We'd love to still be in Rumford. And if there is a location that works for us, we certainly will look at it. Employees have been offered the option to transfer to other Martin's locations. Those who do not wish to relocate will be given a separation package based on their years of service. In Rumford, Brad Rogers, CBS 13 News.